to beat and great cyclone to end the run what's up youtube it's my word here back with an 11 truck beaming g freestyle in new orleans last week's winner was american scout so he'll have the honor of going last the awards final scoreboard as well as timestamps will be in the description this will be the last show before the Beam and G World Finals, so getting in the top five here is crucial. The rules are the same as always. Clock starts once we hit our first obstacle. If the truck crashes before the fourth hit, we'll reset it, and it'll go again, but be deducted one point from each judge. The perfect score is a 30, and without further ado, enjoy. The truck honored to kick it off will be... Hellcat. I wanted Prowler, but the mod didn't install him, so I had to substitute, and this guy fit perfectly. He has glowing eyes, rugged tires, and cool smoke coming out the sides when he's running. Let's try to make the run just as good. Anyway, let's get this show on the road. Clock starts now. Getting a little crazy, getting a little out of control, but we're we we are good. Oh, nice, kind of right in this middle part. You can get some good jumps off of that. Hit that racing ramp. You gotta watch out for these trees on the side. They will destroy the graphics as well as the truck. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh, that was close, but it was a bit of a cool save. So, end up going for the better, and let's get a cross thread. Nicely done. Sweet. Let's hit these bolts. These bolts don't really do much, so it's kind of disappointing. Look at that. Take down that van. Let's. Oh boy. Oh boy. Don't want that. Oh, we do not want that. That is bad. This might put a stop to our run, unless I can pull out of it. Nice! Almost got like a no slap wheelie. That was awesome. And we got like about 30 seconds left in the run, so time to step it up. Or continue stepping it up like we just did there. Oh boy, there goes the hood. The hood falls off pretty easily with this truck. Oh boy! Oh boy! Nice save! This is a great first run. I think nice pogo we're gonna fill the clock there we go the time has been filled and hellcat is gonna put up a big score for the rest of the truck to beat and great cyclone to end the run sweet well ladies and gentlemen the bar is set pretty high at a 28 and its first opponent is wild hair a simple design for a scrawny truck. I've hardly seen any action from him other than a clip from my Crash Madness video. So we're going to have an interesting time here with him. So unlike a uh, Hellcat, I don't think I want to start with that little bump right there. Instead, I want to try something a little bit bigger. Let's try this. Now, I didn't get much off of it. But that's just the way it's gonna go. We're gonna start. No, so kind of disappointing, anticlimactic, but nice air to redeem it. And let's do a reverse move. I don't want to lose. Well, you don't get deductions for reversing in this, but I still want to stay a bit more genuine than that. Anyway. Let's try across it from the other side. Nice, though didn't get the pogo like Hellcat did. It's gonna hurt him because the judges are gonna see that Hellcat did better, so Hellcat deserves more points for it. I'm trying to turn and hit that red lane, but it's just not working for me. Oh boy! This won't either, but can we save it? No! That was close but did not pull it out tough break for wild hair looks like we're never gonna hit that red lane so i'll be back with the next truck 
So I was gonna do a truck called Tremor at this point, but his body doesn't load in for the mod. So instead we have what I imagine is Mike Varder's old truck, Overkill. I don't know a thing about this truck other than his modern day counterpart, so this will be the first time I see it do anything. So, let's get this started. Clock starts now. Nice. And, to this van, great air! That's the first head-on hit for that van, it was executed perfectly. Now let's hit this. What a yellow lane. Nice and gonna get a little bit of a pogo. Pretty nice one. Certainly the uh, best, like, nose up in the air of the night, I guess you could call it. Oh boy, oh boy, gonna get eyesight. Can we save it? Yes, but is that wheel stuck? No, it is not, so we're good. Let's try to reverse into the yellow lane. Nicely done. Overkill. Looks like he's throwing down something here. To this. Nice. Oh boy. Oh boy. No. Oh no. Oh. And it bounced us back up. What are the odds? That was amazing. He's gonna get a cross thread on this van. Nicely done. We're destroying this track. I think we've hit basically every obstacle. The time has almost been filled, like 20 seconds left, so... Yeah, we can just turn it loose right here. Actually, I don't think I've hit this yet. Oh, boy! Oh, boy! Oh, my goodness! And we land it! What a run! The time has been filled, and what a run by Overkill. The body is destroyed. Hardly anything is left, and... There we go down. That was impressive. It might, I think it will take the lead, though. Doesn't have much room to do so. Ladies and gents, as you can imagine, Overkill is your new leader with a perfect 30. So the only way you might come home with a trophy is to tie for the victory. For the tiebreaker has not yet been invented. First to try and do so is our first returning competitor from Arizona Custom, Reptoid. He had a pretty tough run last week, so he's looking to redeem himself here tonight. This is probably the most pressure a driver can have on himself in this era, so Reptoid may have another rough time, but he does have a good chance of making it into the top five, and that's all you need to reach the World Finals at this event here tonight. So, hopefully he can do that, and not worry too much about taking home the victory, because the odds are pretty slim. Anyway. Let's start with, I'm thinking I'm going to start... It's something that most drivers would not recommend, though I'm crazy, so... We're gonna start off big as we can with the van! Nice way to kick it off! Clock has started, the clock has begun, the time has begun. And... We need to light it up if we want to get into this top five. Now we have a lot to compete with. We did just get a good, nice air. We need to do better. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Can this save it? Nicely done. And a slap. Willie to boot. Oh, boy. That racing lane pulled us right back down. But I think we're okay. Let's jump this red lane. Nicely done. Sir. Sid, let's destroy the rest of this yellow wall here, shall we? Let's hit this. Nice air. Oh boy, but that might be too close to the wall. Can it save it? Come on. Oh boy. Yes. Well, now the truck looks dope. And I'm thinking I'm going to throw it into a cyclone. Let's try and do it. We're about to finish the clock, so... Doesn't matter if we go over a little bit early, because... We're in, let's face it. We're not going to beat that Mike Varda's run. Speaking of redeeming yourself, the truck that kicked off our season with the lowest score of the year 
Excalibur comes back for a chance to make it to the World Finals. This time with a more retro look. And I really hope it does make it, because I love this truck. He is at the end of the first half, so the trucks behind him are all heavy hitters in this sport. So let's try and start this run off, as hopefully amazing, with the uh, yellow lane. With a nice pogo right off the bat. Great way to start the clock. Oh, and we cleared that yellow barrier quite nicely. And a little jump off the bump. And then let's hit these bolts. Oh, nicely done. Oh, we're going to hit that pace lane. Oh, and it's going to break us. It's going to make this run harder, but it may also make it give that ragged edge. That knees and look at that air. We got with a broken truck. No, no, yes. Nice save and a cross thread. We're going to do that. Man, I'm getting real cautious with this truck, though. Set it from this. Then let's hit the red racing lane since we haven't hit that yet. Nicely done. This truck will not line up properly, so all the hits will be slightly crooked. That might be really awesome for us. We're hitting almost every obstacle, so that's a step in the right direction. I don't think this will take the lead, though. It's gonna get close, definitely in the top five. Unless a truck behind it just throws it out of the park, which we'll see. Oh boy, oh boy, and that will be all she wrote. But the time has expired, so good timing. Surprisingly, the first appearance of the most well-known female driver in the sport, Medusa, will start the second half. This is the farewell design, but is ironically the closest I could get to her debut design. And other than that, it is gorgeous. An amazing truck. One of the best designs I've ever seen in this game, in this sport. It's really good, so that's going to be great motivation to give it a great run. So, let's get this show on the road. I'm really excited to drive this truck. Start off with a cross thread, and amazing one at that. Wow. Let's go this. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. That was a nice save. Spectacular. Nice combo. Turn it around. Oh, boy. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, nice. Pulled it down to not let it get away from us. And are we going to hit this van? We are. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Amazing luck because I had no control of that whatsoever. Uh, let's hit this racing lane again. Nice. Very well done. This is going perfectly. Not off the walls, but it's doing great enough. Oh, boy. Straight up and down. That is what you want to see. And have about 20 to 30 seconds left on our clock. Said this. Said this. Uh, cross it on this little jump. Nice. To this. Oh boy. Oh man. Oh. Yeah, we're broken for sure, but we are about to fill the clock, so it doesn't really matter that much. Let's hit this van again, shall we? Nicely done. Oh boy. Oh boy. And I think we are stuck. Though the time has just run out, so. Like Excalibur, great timing. Another one back from the first show is Mr. Excitement and the Avenger. Didn't score high enough to reach the world finals at that show, so this is his last hope.
So I hope he can do it. So let's start this off. Try and start it off right. Oh, nice. Nice little wheelie. Oh boy. Oh boy, those holes are so annoying. Let's hit this van. Nicely done. Great air. Slap wheelie. Oh boy, by the might. Ugh. It almost went bad south for us, but we're okay. Nice. Bit of a cross thread. See if we can hit this properly. We sure can, but oh no! And that may not have been the fourth hit, but this might be the end for Avenger. I'm gonna get this sad moment out of the way right now. Avenger will not make it to the World Finals. Guess what? Blacksmith isn't available in my mod, and Mr. Destruction is the next best thing. I don't think this truck was even used in freestyle yet, just as an encore truck, so we're really settling here. Not that this truck isn't dope. Let's start this run off. Clock starts now with this black with skull and crossbones. Black and white truck, this is an amazing simple design. So, not too bad that we have to substitute uh, it for blacksmith. Or vice versa, I guess. Oh, said this. Nice. Uh, Try to get a slap in, but. Couldn't quite make it. Let's hit this yellow lane. Oh boy. Oh boy. Can we save it? Oh boy. No. Can we? Oh. The wheels, the suspension didn't quite do it. Very surprisingly, this week we will not get a run from Goldberg. Instead, we'll get it from the truck he beat in 2000, Gunslinger. Last week, this truck, like Avenger, didn't score high enough to qualify for the World Finals. And also, like Avenger, this truck is too iconic to leave out. So I switched out Goldberg for him to give him a second chance. Let's take it. Anyway, clock starts now. Decent. Oh, amazing! Completely vertical slap, Willie. That was in like in almost like a split second. Fastest move I've ever seen in this sport. Oh, yes, nicely done. Look at this, nice. Oh boy, oh no, can we save it? Oh boy, not, not quite. And that will be the end for Gunslinger as well. Tough times is the way it goes. Gravedigger, famous truck. One first week, third last week. Let's see how it does this week. Ooh, bit of a power wheelie. Oh, oh boy. Getting a little bit wild. He's already making it to the world final since he's won the whole thing. And gone in the top five twice. Oh boy, but... Oh, can he save this? He sure can, and this is a good time for a reverse move. Let's do over these cars. Can't quite do it. Got to do one over the van, but I might save that for American Scout to do the way he did with that bus last week. I can't get a solid hit in with Gravedeer, so... Got to step it up here. Oh boy. Oh, gonna get high sided. Oh, that. Uh, I talked trash about the poles uh, with uh, Avenger, but that time it saved my truck's life. To this. Nicely done. Oh, but that is not so nicely done, though. I don't think I have much time left. Oh boy. Oh boy. Let's, oh no, that is quite lucky, though, yeah, this is not going to get the lead, though, it's starting to get pretty uh, 
entertaining. This truck is absolutely demolished. The hood's gone. The both wheels are destroyed. Got flat tires. And why not? Let's throw it into a cyclone. I think that'll be it for Gravedigger. American Scout is last up. And the final run to determine who makes to the first Beaming G World Finals is last week's champion, American Scout. This guy threw down an insane run in Arizona Custom, but I think he might have to step it up if he wants to two in a row. So like I said with Gravedigger, I want to do a reverse over this van right here. So we're going to do that right now. And nice, great, just as good as last week, and great way to start the run, announcing our presence. This is basically going to be an encore, unless follows that up with even more sick moves to tie a 30 to get a perfect score. I also want to do this. I want to crawl over Grave Digger here. Come on, can we do it? Oh, it might just get stuck. Oh, boy! And we go down. Destroying. Oh, my gosh! We just annihilated Grave Digger. An inferno is erupting. Well, that ended in a hot mess, but clearly not a perfect 30. Actually, that's the dead last score with a 7. Meaning Overkill is your champion here tonight, ladies and gentlemen. Congrats to Overkill for throwing down the best run of the night and of the season, living up to its name. And since next week is the World Finals, we have the full lineup here today. Your 16 competitors will be Hellcat, Reptoid, Sudden Impact, Medusa, American Scout, Excalibur, Vet King, No Problem, Sting, Gunslinger, Overkill, King Crunch, Carolina Crusher, Combustion, and Goldberg, and Grave Digger. That said, that'll be it for this video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to hit that like button so I know. And make sure you don't miss the first Beam and G World Finals by hitting the subscribe button and hitting the notification bell so you don't miss it when it comes out. And without further ado, be great, stay awesome, drive.